autocracy is doomed in the age of Facebook. <clears throat> but this day of age, this day of age, social media has already expanded its community uh, in order to get in touch with other people in other countries. But autocracy is a type of leadership that is gov governed by one person with absolute power. Though it is well known for making autocratic leaders to become overwhelmed and abuse their power, becoming a tyranny to their country. But in this era, social media was not only used for people expressing themselves online or for entertainment purposes, but also it is a mode of information. People nowadays use social media often, and news outlets took this advantage to inform people of the said platform on what is happening to the society. But the autocratic leaders has the power to close the communications to, uh, to other countries, just like what the North Korea did to their country, shutting down any means of com communication and the rights of their people. The effects of autocracy on the society. An autocratic leader style, uh, leadership style is a more authoritative, meaning likely to be respected or behave upon. Business owners use autocratic leadership to ensure all employees are on the same page with the business owners. Autocratic leadership often creates a more stressful uh, work environment. In the business industry, employees may worry less about completing business functions to the best possible outcome and more about avoiding punishments from leaders and managers. They can also force uh, face strict punishment or penalties for operating out, outside company guidelines. Autocracy is also a form of leadership in some countries, especially North Korea. And their leader Kim Jong Un, who is who was a leader who is the leader of the country since 2011. And it is believed that he is an autocratic leader. North Korea is well known for conducting nuclear testing and spending their spending their mo money on firearms to prepare to prepare them on war for war yet never took notice of their people who are dying from hunger or restricting the rights of their people Yong Mi Park is a human rights activist who was born in North Korea she talks about how freedom is precious for the people who are oppressed from the brutality of North Korean regime so that so what's the purpose of Facebook in Chad O'Carroll's article entitled the mysterious networking filling social media with anti North Korea graphics shown that people in the internet took notice of this problem and made anti North Korea graphics that circled around the networking sites and social media. According to Chad O'Carroll, 2018, a mysterious network of dozens of websites, blogs, and social media accounts have, have since May 2015 been posting hundreds of cartoons, infographics, and political messages criticizing North Korea's human rights, re human rights record. And leader Kim Jong-un, and investigating by NK News has, has shown. As, as you may see in these pictures, graphics was made by. So, what do we do? As users of social media, we must be aware of all the things that is occurring, occur, occurring in the internet and let everyone know. The situation at hand though making actions is impossible for us <clears throat> so, uh, but sharing the situation online 
will let the people know and be knowledgeable about the situation. These people escape the oppression from their own country and it's important for us to share their experiences and their voice that they speak for the people who are who are still oppressed from the autocratic leaders. What about autocracy? Autocratic leaders have the power to control the media, have power to control the society of their country, and use punishing uh, system. Whereas the democratic system use a judge system, have a rule of law, and the common good, meaning the decision, are made for the benefits of everyone. Autocracy is doomed in this day of age because people, not only in social media, but around the world, speaks for, for their and others' freedom. Thank you.